Hey, what's going on everybody? Saljun F1 here, and today we're gonna to be talking about improving your aim. Now, I have been huge on trying to get my aim to get better and better and better, and I recently came across some information that I'm gonna be linking below, but from Kovac himself, about what he thinks is the best way to improve your aim. Now, before we get into the details of what he said, I just wanna say I've been working on this, and I am way more confident I've ever been with my shots, and I'm excited to explain to you the things that I've been doing. Now, as you can see right here, Kovac responded to a Reddit thread about what somebody should be doing in Kovacs. Now, as he says here, he says that he's of the opinion that tracking aim is more important than flick shot aim. I found this to be surprising because everybody's working on their flick shots, including me at the time, and I thought that that was more shotgun aiming, whereas tracking is more SMG, assault rifle kind of thing. But Kovac goes on to recommend a couple different modes to practice with tracking, and that he tells you the kind of percentage to aim for. And those modes are the long strafes, fast strafes, and ascended tracking and trying to get those to about 60% in the long strafes, fast strafes about 40%, and ascended tracking to about 60% as well. He doesn't say to ignore things like Tile Frenzy altogether. He just says if you if you can't get 100, a score of 100 on those, then maybe you should continue grinding that. But once you get to there, there's no reason to keep pushing and pushing whatever he thinks you should start putting your attention more to tracking game as well. So like I said, I'm gonna have this in the description below so you can go ahead and read all his recommendations and things like that. But in this video, I'm gonna show you exactly kind of what he was talking about. So the first things first, when you first load it in, you're gonna wanna go to game options if you don't have this already. Just make sure you have your FOV at 80. You can put your Fortnite slider here. Also go ahead in the description and you'll see like in, in the link provided as you, if you scroll down on that thread, people talk about how to get your actual sensitivity because in Fortnite they use a slider that's not 100% accurate, but I'm just using it anyway just because it's close enough and it's it'll be fine for me. But you can change the background color, you can put it on your whatever res that you are using and you can also change your crosshair. So let's just pick one of the modes and I'm gonna show you. So you would pick the mode, right? This is the thin aiming and then you would hit free play. In here, you can, you'll see what it looks like. This is what it looks like. So you're supposed to keep your crosshair on there and shoot that, right? What you can also do and to help incrementally getting better and actually develop better mechanics in your arm and your movement, things like that, is you go to time scale and you can slow it down. So you can get to a 0.3, right? Now we're gonna shoot it. Now I'm gonna show you, once you actually start trying to track this thing, you can see there's a lot of jitters in my hands and that's what I've been trying to not do. <laughs> but also I'm not warmed up but I'm just doing it for the video. Um, but right, so I'm at 54.8% right there. It shows you your session up there and then you can kind of see exactly where you're at. You go through a couple targets, what I do, and let's go through like six targets or maybe even 10 targets of killing. See if I can maintain uh, something around 60% and then let's up it. So if I do, I'll go back in, change the time scale to 0.4. And now I hit play again, hit F3 so you can reset the session. You'll see the stat just went away and then when I shoot it again, there you go, stats came back. Now you can do this for all these different sessions and you can just keep going that, practice your aiming, reset the time scale, keep working on it, keep, and then progressively get better and then when you're ready, you can actually play the challenge which is more of a timed thing where you get scored at the end. So what I like to do is I do this and then uh, I'll just go back and try to beat my score after I, get, I warm up and I actually try to practice and push my aiming and get better. Then I'll actually do the challenge and see if I can beat my old score. And my scores have been shooting through the roof and I've been feeling so much more confident in game and I really that's why I'm like really back in this right now and I highly recommend doing this. And like I showed earlier, that thi the thin aiming long, I think this one right here to me is the best one. Um, I know he recommended all those and I keep doing, especially the fast, fast straights are pretty hard so that one's a really good one too. But if you can do this one, you can do this one, you can do this one, this one is tough. So I liked practicing on this and then going back into ascended tracking and then working on that after I like warm up with this and try to get better at having a more smooth tracking pattern rather than a little jittery. And the one that he talks about with trying to get a hundred a score of 100 is right here at Tile Frenzy. But there you have it guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hopefully you'll be able to get this game. It is 10 bucks, but it's totally worth it. Hop in there, take these, take these tips. They've been working for me. Really happy about it. And I hope you guys will be able to take this advice and take it in and then see the improvements in your own game play. If you guys did enjoy this video, go ahead and hit a thumbs up. Let me know what you think about it in the comment section. And if you're not subscribed, go ahead and do so. Your boy coming out with guides and commentaries and things like this all the time. I also do have supporter creators. So if you wanted to put my code in, it's just my name, Soldier F1. Thank you guys for watching and you guys all have a good day.